Hello everyone and welcome to the Love and Living Planet Aquarium. My name is Megan and I'm one of the educators here at the Aquarium and today we're going to be talking about sea turtles. In fact, we have one of our sea turtles coming over right now. This is our loggerhead sea turtle, one of two that makes their home here at the Love and Living Planet Aquarium. Now, sea turtles have amazing adaptations that allow them to be right at home in the ocean and in our enclosure. And their most well-known adaptation is, of course, their shell. Our loggerhead's giving you a nice view of the bottom of her shell. And I also have a green sea turtle shell right here that you guys can get a close look at as well. Now, sea turtle shells, believe it or not, are made of the same material as your fingernails. So if you touch your fingernail and feel it, that's what a sea turtle shell is going to feel like. And they also have nerves underneath their shell, just like we do for our fingers, so they can actually feel when someone is touching them, which allows them to be able to sense things around them as they are swimming throughout their home in the ocean or here in the aquarium. Sea turtles have other very cool adaptations that are with their shell. If you take a look, you can see how the spine and all of the ribs of the sea turtle are part of their shell. This makes it extra strong so that if other animals, such as certain species of sharks, try to take a chomp out of them, they're still able to survive and adapt to their environment. It's a way that they have an extra layer of armor, if you will, on their body. I have other very cool things to show you guys about our sea turtles. In fact, this is the jaw and skull of a green sea turtle, that same species as our shell. And if you take a look, you can see how their beak, as it is called, is kind of like a set of scissors. This is perfect for being able to eat their favorite kinds of food in the ocean. Can any of you guys guess what a sea turtle's favorite food is? It depends on the type of sea turtle, but green sea turtles love to eat different kinds of leafy greens that grow in the ocean, such as kelp, seaweed, or seagrasses. But when they're younger, they have a completely different diet, and it's mostly going to be sea jellies. Now, if you're a young sea turtle trying to find sea jellies out in the ocean, it can be pretty difficult to tell the difference between sea jellies and something else that's in the ocean. If you take a look at this, and if you were a sea turtle to see this swishing in the water of the ocean, would you be able to tell whether it is a plastic bag or a sea jelly? I don't know, I have a hard time telling the difference, and so do a lot of sea turtles, which unfortunately means that many sea turtles accidentally eat plastic bags that are found drifting in the ocean. As a young sea turtle, that's what their main food source is. They want those sea jellies, and sometimes they eat a plastic bag thinking it's their favorite food. Thankfully for our sea turtles, they have the perfect habitat and perfect diet to stay nice and healthy here at the aquarium. In fact, they are both rescue animals. They were not able to survive in the ocean due to different kinds of injuries, and they were brought to the aquarium to be able to be provided a new and wonderful home. And ever since we received them years ago, they have been happy as a clam, as it were. This is one of the wonderful ways that we can have a direct impact not only on the animals that we see in our own backyard, but also animals all the way out in the ocean. Next time you guys go shopping, try to use a reusable bag rather than a plastic one, or a reusable container rather than a plastic one. Every time you do that, it's one less bit of plastic that ends up in the oceans that helps us save animals such as our sea turtles. Now I'd like to thank you guys for joining us today at the Love and Living Planet Aquarium. Be sure to tune in next time at 3 o'clock tomorrow for more amazing video of our animals. Have a wonderful day everyone and thank you for joining us.